only built it about two days ago and it's been drying and now it's ready to erupt. Mm -hmm. now. now. So what are the three things we're going to add to this volcano? We are going to add some citric acid. Citric acid. Sodium bicarbonate, which is baking soda. Right. And some crystal pops. Yes, which will give it that nice volcano sound, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, you're going to first add the, the sodium bicarbonate. So we're going to add about one tablespoon of each. One tablespoon. Yeah, I think this is already dyed. Oh, yeah, it's got some red dye in it. Is it a tablespoon? Yeah, that's about a tablespoon. Put it in. Cool. You start adding that, and I'll go ahead and cut this one open for us. Yeah. Do you want to add that? Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, you go ahead. We're going to cut this. Here's a cup to put that in. Now, we are going to add Now we're going to add some crystal pops. Some crystal pops. Have we ever used crystal pops on a volcano before? No. No, so this will be new for us. You've made lots of volcanoes and we've erupted a lot of volcanoes, but normally just using baking soda and vinegar, right? Yeah. Yeah, so this is kind of a new way. So we have the National Geographic This is our first jum jumbo volcano kit, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not 
coming out the top, huh? Hmm. I got ideas. Maybe we can use some sodium. Let's get some. Just a little bit more baking soda. A little bit more vinegar. Oh. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow, that was pretty cool. Uh oh. Oh my, and it's coming off the table. Well, it took a little bit, but we finally got an eruption, so thanks for watching.